Hello friends, welcome to Vitish Academy. Today in this presentation, we are going to solve an example on independent term of x in the binomial expansion. So here we have to find the independent term of the x in the expansion of the binomial term and the root of x by 3 plus 3 divided by 2x square whole power 10. So first, let us compare the given binomial term with x plus y whole power n. So on comparing, we get the n value as 10, x value as under root of x divided by 3, and we get here the y value as 3 divided by 2x square. So we already know that the general term in the expansion of x plus y whole power n is given by tr plus 1 is equal to ncr into x power n minus r into y power r. Now let us replace the values of n, x and y in this formula. So we get here 10cr into under root x divided by 3 whole power 10 minus r into 3 divided by 2x square whole power r. So this we can write as 10cr into and the root of x by 3 can be written as x by 3 whole power 1 by 2 whole power 10 minus r into 3r divided by 2 power r into x power 2r. So we can write this as 10cr and here we can apply the formula x power m minus n is equal to x power m divided by x power n. So by comparing here the term with the formula, we get the x value as x divided by 3 whole power 1 by 2. So by applying the formula, we can write this as x divided by 3 whole power 1 by 2 whole power 10 divided by x divided by 3 whole power 1 by 2 whole power r into 3 power r divided by 2 power r. And here we can write 1 by x power 2r as x power minus 2r. So in the next step, we can write this as 10cr. And here, by simplifying, we get 2 1 time is 2 and 2 5 times is 10. So, this would be x by 3 whole power 5 divided by x by 3 whole power r divided by 2 into 3 power r divided by 2 power r into x power minus 2r. So, this would come as 10cr into x power 5 divided by 3 power 5. And now here, let us reciprocal the denominator term. So, we get here 3 to the power r divided by 2 divided by x power r divided by 2 into 3 power r divided by 2 power r into x power minus 2 r. And now here let us group the x terms and the constant term 3 terms. So on grouping here we get 10 cr into x power 5 into 1 by x power r by 2 can be written as x power minus r by 2 into x power minus 2 r. And now let us group here the constant term 3. So we get here 1 by 3 power 5 as 3 power minus 5 into 3 power r by 2 into 3 power r into 1 by 2 r. So here we observe that the bases are equal. So on adding the powers, we get here 10 cr into x power 5 minus r by 2 minus 2 r into 3 power minus 5 plus r by 2 plus r into 1 by 2 r. So we can write this as 10 cr and now let us simplify the power of x. So here we have 5 minus r divided by 2 minus 2r. So let us take LCM as 2 here. We get the numerator terms as 10 minus r minus 4r is equal to 10 minus r minus 4r would come as here minus 5r divided by 2. So this we can write as 10 divided by 2 minus 5r divided by 2. So on simplifying we get here 2 1 time is 2 and 2 5 times is 10. So we get here x power 5 minus 5r divided by 2. Now let us simplify the power of 3. So we have here minus 5 plus r divided by 2 plus r. Now let us take 2 as the LCM. We get here the numerator terms as minus 10 plus r plus 2r. So this we can write as minus 10 divided by 2 plus r plus 2r would be here 3r divided by 2. So here by simplifying we get 2 1 time is 2 and 2 5 times is 10. So we get here 3 to the power minus 5 plus 3r divided by 2 into 1 by 2r. Now here as we have to find the independent term, let us equate the power of x to 0. So here we have the power of x as 5 minus 5r divided by 2 is equal to 0. So now let us transfer minus 5r divided by 2 to the right hand side. We get here 5r divided by 2 is equal to 5. So on cross multiplying this, we get here 5r is equal to 10. Now by simplifying, we get 5 1 time is 5 and 5 2 times is 10. So we get here the r value as 2. Now let us substitute the r value as 2 in this equation. So on substituting, we get 10c2 into x power 5 minus 5 into 2 divided by 2. 
into 3 minus 5 plus 3 into 2 divided by 2 into 1 by 2 square. So here we can cancel out 2 and 2 in the numerator and denominator. Similarly, let us cancel over here 2 and 2. So we get here 10c2 into x power 5 minus 5 would be here 0 into 3 power minus 5 plus 3 would come as minus 2 into 1 by 2 square is 1 by 4. So this we can write as 10c2 into x power 0 into 3 power minus 2 can be written as 1 by 3 square into 1 by 4. Now let us find the value of the binomial coefficient 10c2. So here we get as 10 factorial divided by 10 minus 2 factorial into 2 factorial and here the value of x power 0 would be 1 into 1 by 3 square is 9 into 1 by 4. So now let us find the value of this binomial coefficient. So we get here 10 into 9 into 8 factorial divided by 8 factorial into 2 into 1. So here we can cancel our 8 factorial in the numerator and denominator and again here by simplifying we get 2 1 times 2 and 2 5 times is 10. So here on multiplying 5 and 9 we get here 45 divided by 9 4 times is 36. So the independent term of the binomial term would be 45 divided by 36. So this was a basic introduction on how to solve an example on independent of x in the binomial expansion. Hope you understood the concept. Do like and subscribe to vdshacademy.com. Thanks for watching. Have a good day.